All praises to the most high. God is the greatest. All praises to the most high. God is the greatest. All praises to the most high. God is the greatest. All praises to the most high. God is the greatest. All praises to the most high. God is the greatest. I believe you already know that right now, right? I believe you already see what's going on, right? Do you see what's going on right now? Can you see what I see? <laughs> Today is Saturday. Yes, the beautiful Saturday. It's sunny Saturday. Sunny Saturday. Let's me know that you can play. You can play when it feel good outside. When it feel real good outside, you can go outside and play, can't you? Do you got a neighborhood you can play in? Huh? Do y'all love this neighborhood that I'm walking in? This is a new development right here in Charlotte, South Carolina. Me, I enjoy this wonderful atmosphere. Go on and get you a smell in through your nose. You ready to get on the boat? All praises to the most high God is the greatest. All praises to the most high God is the greatest. The more you surrender to the universe, and what I mean by surrendering is, I got hands right there. So, what's so, up? So. <laughs> Today is an amazing day. All praises to the Most High God is the greatest. And I believe if you was to ask the universe, the power of the world, the universal God, for something that you really desire, like, uh, how we doing? How you doing today? All right, all right. I believe if you was to ask for something from the universe, like you can ask for healing in your body. You can say, I want to be healed today. You can say, I want to be rich. You can say, I want to be more intelligent. You can say, I want to be more lovable. You can say, I want to be more positive. You can say these things, but you're going to be tested. The test has come to see if you a man or a caterpillar. Are you a man or a caterpillar? Because both of them are great. If you a man, you can be a, a man like me. Or you can be a beautiful woman like her over there. You can be a caterpillar, which first start out eating the larva, which is green vegetables and plants. And then this caterpillar turns into the beautiful butterfly. The beautiful butterfly that's shining, you know what I mean? This caterpillar changed its life when it started flying. Then after it's flying, now it's drinking the juice. It's taking and sucking the nectar out of the flowers. It went from eating vegetables to drinking juice. Why? Because it's always floating, baby. The butterfly is always floating. That's why Muhammad Ali said, I float like a butterfly and I sting like a bee. But you know my name is Elisha Lee. My name is Elisha Lee. Y'all like that Mercedes right there? Ain't it good to have neighbors that are beautiful? You can walk around your neighbors, say, hey, how you doing today, neighbor? But you got to create something that you want. Listen, got to feed every bird, but it ain't going to put the food in his nest. The bird got to go out and get that food. Sometimes I watch birds and I wonder how they do what they do, but they do it. Look at this car right here. That's a beautiful car right here. Look. How we doing today? You got a beautiful car. Thank you, thank you. Beautiful home. Beautiful life. I'll praise it to the most high God is the greatest. I really love you so much 
that I am transparent with my life. The same way my mentor, Wesley, billion dollar version, is very transparent with his life. He let me see his condo. Inside his condo, he got a $10,000 couch, a $5,000 chandelier, a $5,000 table. He got another $2,000 love seat. He got a $5,000 lamp. It's a cactus lamp. He got $2,000 Yeezy shoes. $2,000 Yeezy shoes. He got a $46,000 Hublot watch. He got a $100,000 Rolex watch. He got an AP bracelet. He's very transparent with his life. Why? Because he ain't got nothing to hide. It is real. Life is real when you enjoy what you're doing. See, you only hiding when you don't like what you're doing. At nighttime, you're probably creeping in rooms doing stuff. At nighttime, you're probably going out looking for something to do because you're hiding. Remember, God said, God took the prophet John on the Lord's Day, on a Sunday. And John said he was in prayer or meditation. And God took him into the caves and found all these memorable things people was putting in there and they was worshiping. God said, don't you know I see everything you do? If you ain't happy with your life to be outside like this, all praises, then you hide from yourself. The same thing with Cain and Abel. God told Cain, like, you got something working on the inside you got to work with. Sin is at the door. Love your life so you can express your love through the atmosphere of the world. I love you. I thank God for you. We stay winning. I love you. You are a winner. Hit the link at the top and join the program and get you a mentor and be a part of this new, this new love. It's nothing but love right here, baby. My name is Elisha.